Samuel Alito is now complaining that he is being treated unfairly. So let's uncover the truth. According to a new report from the Wall Street Journal, Republican Supreme Court Justice Samuel Alito complained that, quote, we are being hammered daily and I think quite unfairly in a lot of instances and nobody, practically nobody, is defending us, end quote. He's saying this because public trust in the Supreme Court has been on the steep decline since the draft opinion of Roe v. Wade was leaked. And of course, Republicans like Samuel Alito and the other MAGA justices are more upset about the leak than they are about women's reproductive freedoms being overturned. Speaking of unfair, we have corrupt Republican Supreme Court justices who have all been caught in their own various forms of corruption. We have Clarence Thomas, who is effectively bought out by the billionaire right-wing donor Harlan Crow. Not to mention Clarence Thomas's wife, Ginny, texted 29 lawmakers urging them to overturn the election results. Then we have Chief Justice John Roberts, whose wife raked in a whopping $10 million from elite law firms, some of whom argued cases before her husband. Of course, we have Brett Kavanaugh, the twice accused rapist, and not to mention Kavanaugh, Roberts, and Barrett were all appointed by a twice impeached insurrectionist Donald Trump. So from where I sit, we the people are being treated unfairly. We have to live under the authoritarian right-wing rule of a bunch of illegitimate justices who lied under oath during their confirmation hearings and have decided to impose their religious beliefs onto the rest of us. In conclusion, the Supreme Court remains an illegitimate branch of the United States government so long as Alito, Clarence Thomas, Amy Coney Barrett, Brett Kavanaugh, and Chief Justice John Roberts remain seated on the bench. Thank you guys for watching and I will continue to uncover the truth.